Hello and good evening to everyone. So we're going to be doing a bit of streaming today. And it's kind of up to you guys what we want to do. Uh, I should also be streaming on five different platforms this time. I've gone uh, a bit nuts. Uh, so I've actually set up something called um, Periscope and also Smash T Smashcast, I think it's called. So hopefully we should be on, on all of those ones as well as Twitch and YouTube and all that kind of stuff. And hopefully as well, chat should be working. It should be great if the chat, the joint chat, is actually working. That's the goal. But yeah, should all be good. We'll see. We'll see if it works. Ah, it's nice. So I got a nice, really nice, like warm coffee, which is awesome. So anyway, Ugh. up to you guys. Yeah, up to you guys. What we want to do? How's it going? We've got Dragon Wave and also Ali Hadi. And my chat is huge. I've just I've just noticed the scale of the chat is absolutely massive. I'm gonna cut it down a little bit. I'm using Restream, which um still got in the hang of. Obviously we we well, I didn't sort out last time very well. There we go, that's better. Or is it? <laughs> I should have done it. That should have sorted it out. But it didn't. Why didn't it? Oh, there we go, we can actually do other stuff to do it. Also got um Bart, how's it going Bart? We also got uh, Lieutenant Robin, Tom Van Villa, Stanley. How's it all going guys? So, should we start on the school night's pool thing? Or should we do something else? Is this going to be too big? Yeah, it's possible that it's going to be too big. It's, it's a pretty big build actually. It's really quite a big build. Mm. <laughs> Mega build. Just looking at this and doing the whole old school kind of roof type thing. Um, because why not? Because why not? So there we go. So apparently I can't connect to Smashcast. Well, that doesn't really matter since I've never streamed on it before. But, pff, whatever. Should have been working. Hopefully Twitch is working as well. And hopefully I can see the chat for it. Uh, we also got Tyler Kui. 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 Uh, how long am I going to be streaming? I don't know. Uh, hour... Two hours, maybe. How's it going? Art Gunslinger as well. It's got Amiria Manzano. How's it going, man? Alright, let me fix this a little bit. I did want compact, didn't I? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. It kind of works. Student Sand Place. How's it going, man? Good to see you. So, yeah, we could do could do this building. We could do another one. How's it going, Galadrax? Um... This is going to be quite big. I haven't even got a staircase in here. Normally I'd like to sort out a staircase. Uh, so that's a little bit bizarre for me. Too far, I have no idea where it would actually go. Ooh, okay. So I can't go there. So this is actually, it's quite small, isn't it? It is quite small and thin at the top of this bit. So I actually will probably want to split it into two anyway. Or, or have like a staircase going up. Hmm. Oh, I see where, where it's going to be difficult. Made it weird. <laughs> Made it really weird. Oh man. How's it going? Uh you and Aaron Lowe, how's it going? Back in an hour I gotta drive home. No worries, man. No worries at all. But yeah. Sitting Sand just finished learning. Okay, what have you learned? Much? Not much. <laughs> right. Even if we're just gonna wait until people come online and everything like that and just gonna like check it out, but I should be able to see the chat from everywhere except Smashcast, because I think that's the one that's broke. Or Periscope. I don't know, Smashcast is saying the chat's working, but the actual stream isn't. And Periscope... <laughs> Periscope, which I've never used before, is saying that the uh, uh, the chat's not working, but the video is. That's, that's brilliant, that is. Absolutely brilliant. Dragon Wave, how's it going? Need to go. Got homeworks. Oh. Well, to be fair, you can't help that. What am I going to be making? Uh, green raccoon. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to see what we're going to be making. I did. I was kind of like looking at this uh, just a second ago. Uh, I do not like how this is going to be the only real way to get up, unless that's the other thing. This entrance here, we make into a really weird kind of windy thing, and then we're going to end up having really weird rooms, aren't we? Wow, that is that is Yo, really. Are finally able to donate. Just want to thank you for all the amazing content and. Damn, thanks, Bart. Inspiration Bart. to start building conquest. 
Thanks, bro. You and your vids were the main inspiration for the founding of Darwin Reforged. Cool. Thanks, Hashtag man. Hashtag shameless plug. <laughs> You've got to get those shameless plug plugs in. I have no idea what happened with the like the event thing then, the actual alerts. It, it just came out huge. What happened? Oh, I don't know. But yeah, thanks so much, man. That was just weird, wasn't it? It should have come up with um, with something. So I have to have a fix of that at some point. Ugh. How's it going, Roman Eagle? Uh, what am I working on? Not too much, actually. Not too much. Yeah. So I think... Yeah, we'll have a... I'm going to have to make it go up somehow. I think. I think it's the only way, isn't it? Which means we're going to have to have some sort of weird-ass staircase type thing. We just split it up, to be fair. It's huge. So we, we've got to split this place up. Even if we don't do this as the actual main video, I will just want to get like the staircase done, because then we've got that. I mean, this is going to be above it, which is going to be weird. So you're going to walk in, and it's going to be above it. That's it. <laughs> but yeah, how's it going, Big Mac? I oh, it's got Sid77. It's going to be a vote on one you make. Um, what are you going to make? Uh, you could technically do that. Or you can just, you know, if you guys have got any ideas, then you can also say them. Um... It's either way. We did have a... Uh, there was a... What do you call it? Oh, God, I can't even think. Straw poll. Uh, Drax did put... Or Galadrax did put up a, a straw poll for last time. Hemberg won, so it's something Hembergy. Um, it's just I don't really know what... It's going to be really weird, isn't it? It's going to be really funky. And I mean, We could technically block off like a little entrancey thing where we lose the kind of archway. How's it going, Shula? What's been built? Um, a really bad staircase at the minute. That is the whole thing that I'm doing right now. <laughs> I mean, technically it works, doesn't it? You know, you just jump onto it and... Oh, God. Just basically destroy the whole thing. And then you go across here and then you can probably... And probably figure that a bit out with, with a trapdoor. I think I'm just going to escape this place, uh, run, and, and then we'll never leave it. There you go. So look, there we go. That's perfect. That's so bad. <laughs> no. Your vote was a Queen Anne's Revenge Blackbeard ship. I know, but we've already done. We've already done the vote. But I think we'll do that from now on, though. We'll do like a kind of like vote afterwards. It's a funky staircase. It does not work. It's terrible. Um, especially because I kind of wanted this to be whoever the like master of this place, headmaster, or if it's going to be a school. Or something else. God knows. Gadrax wants a new board to build. I feel like I haven't done much exterior in a while. I know, it's because we've been, or I've been working on the um, exterior stuff. So I've been working on all the stuff around here rather than, uh, uh, like, and it's mostly farms and paths and trees. There's, like, not been a lot of proper building stuff to do. So I've mostly just been just spamming the roads. Uh, it takes ages. Takes hours. So that's what I've done. Uh, I've got to do the kind of like wall and smooth it out on all of these darn fields. Um, and I saw a really cool pitch actually uh, today of Ardercraft, and they've done like a Rohan village, and their fields look freaking awesome. So I've got to go and check those out. They just kick ass. They've like properly got you know, um, like the fallowed ones look properly like ditched and everything. I, I don't know what you want to call it. It looks looks amazing. Uh, but yeah, on the board to build anyway. Drax, let's have a look. What we've got going on. Ugh, saddle master construction site. We got burial mounds, pyre, uh, bank, and goldsmith. Ye oldy toy shop. Uh, we got a merchant guild. Obviously, that's quite important. Bird shop, ferrier, embassy, uh, mason, gladiator training areas. The gladiator training areas. Thinking about this the other day, I was thinking of having like a weird something outside the city walls, and then the gladiators come in because they're not like slave gladiators. So they would. It's more like they're going to be training outside of of the normal places. You know, something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Right, okay. How's it going, um Christian as well? We got Christian on. Staircase technically works, I know. I know, it does technically work. It's just uh you know it doesn't really work. You and Arlo going to have to go for bagpipe practice. I didn't even know that was a thing, man. I did not know bagpipe practice was a thing. I thought you just kinda like just do it, you know? But maybe no. Right. 
How's it going, Neo? George Edge Productions as well. We've also got 4TV. Uh, Neo, what did you miss? Not too much, actually. Not, not too much at all. Uh, we're just kind of like chilling. I'm actually going to just completely steal this design that I've kind of got here. Which is really lazy, actually. Um, but amazingly, I can fit all the blocks on the bar, so that would do. Uh, can I do some buildings? Does, do people want me to do some buildings? People bored of, like, just interiors? I've got to interior the place before I finish it. It's, it's got to happen. It's just that um, it does kind of uh, yeah drive you nuts, doesn't it? If that's all we're doing. And at some point I'm going to join up these. I did think about, you know, the caves when we were having the um, barrel maker. Like, maybe we actually have some, like, whatever caves are going past. We can actually see stuff. I don't know. I, I had a weird idea about it. Like, kind of like what I did with, um, back in the day, with... Ah, oh, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What is it called? I can't remember what it's called. Ah, oh, man. Mystic Pines. There we go. Eeh, there we go. That'll do there. Shove that down there. There we go. Now it looks like it's all tied up and everything. And I'm going to have a bucket here instead this time. Whoa. Incredible. I'm pretty sure I'll come back to this design and change it. But it doesn't really matter for now. Um, something, Something's better than nothing. Ooh, jumping up and down. Um, I have also started getting a cold really annoyingly today. Like I woke up with a bit of a cold, so I've taken some some meds which have kind of like stopped it for now. But pff, who knows what's going to happen? <laughs> Breaking news: A criminal stole his design, my own design. <laughs> I don't, is it my design, or have I seen it elsewhere? <laughs> That's the other thing. Oh, it's so difficult sometimes to know what's going on. Right, let's get some thick mud poop block. That's what this one is. Yeah, there you go. Right. And we'll do other stuff to that later on. I don't really like it. I'm actually looking at it and going, I don't really like it. I think it looks too chunky. Right, and the only other thing we can do is kind of like, you know, like push it in or something, you know, make it a little bit more. Can we do it there, can we? From those two side bits we can at least do it so it's like closer, I guess. I think that's what's looking weird as well. Meh. I don't know. New says do some houses. Ah, oh, cool. What's got Connor mine? How's it going, Connor? Do some more toy tour on some backs. Battleships. I'm not really into them at the minute. I'm just not at all. Um, there's Jag Thunder still, I'm sure, doing some. Uh, and also Master Jam. But I'm just not into them. It's just it's a huge amount of like effort for, for doing them. So I just... Pff, if I'm not in the mood, I'm not in the mood. Which is why I'm not being in the mood, I think. It's just that... It's the, it's the monumental amount of effort to not only build them, but do the tutorials on them. Which is why I've kind of been put off them. That wasn't really variation at all, was it? Um, but yeah, that's why I've not been doing them. It's just huge amounts of work. Uh, there's not a lot of gain out of them, I'll be honest. But yeah. <laughs> Shoot, if I'm going to steal one of my own designs, at least make sure it's a good one of yours. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Vadermore has a go, man. Ah, dear. Right. Right. Okay. So, what do you what do you reckon? Houses, things like that. I think this we need to at some point do the roof on. So it's really annoying me. And if we're going to do that, we might as well do some. Might as well do it time lapse as well. So that means I'm going to turn off shades. I'm going to get that extreme on, and I'm just going to go and kick it up. And we'll see what happens. Right. So yeah, how's everything working? Is everything still like kind of like working fine? All seems to be working fine with me um, streaming to five different places at once. Well, four because it didn't really work. Shule, I'm gonna try and fix that funky stair. God no, no, I don't think so. I think we're, I think we're doomed forever now with that. It's gonna be a, you know, just leave it. Never speak of it again. Um, <laughs> we should do really. We really should do. How's it going? James loves Stacy Chambers. By the way, yesterday Mike was so close to you, he could hear you breathe. Ah, okay. Is it better now? Is it better today? 
It's one of those things in my mic because it's um, it's like a I think it's a baseball type <laughs> like mic. It's really random. Uh, I don't know why. Point of it, but I went with like a broadcast one, and it was actually like uh, I think um, they said like people that do baseball commentary use it or something, which is totally not that clear actually when I when I actually think about it. But I gave it a go. So yeah, why why not? How's it going, Arnis? I was got Mr. Mime. Uh, Stitching sand place. I am the orc god, you know, from Discord. Are you now? Because I know you did put down your name, but you, you do that a lot. You put down your own name for a lot. <laughs> um, oh, by the way, I have done some of the site very, very quickly. Very, very quickly. I have been sorting out kind of like a, a racist thing. Because somebody did ask me about races the other day. Um, so what I've tried to do is tried to map it out in like a hierarchy type thing. So the gods, what they've actually created... Um, so like Gaia created the fairies, the Ents, the mermaids, the elves, and the elves are split off into wise elves, which are like high elves, dark elves, wood elves, and snow elves. Odin, yeah, I'm going with the whole Norse thing for the Norse. It just made more sense for that, because then you just get the whole pamphlet you need to have to come up with them yourself. Um, so we got Odin, which obviously were Nords, and then from the Nords you got men, and from men, uh, men and snow elves together became well. Uh, vampires. I don't know where werewolves are going to come from. Don't know where centaurs are going to come from. We're going to have to come up with a story for that. Satyrs apparently came from men, the land of men. But dwarves and wood elves make hobbits. So it's kind of like there. So that's where the orc god kind of thing is coming from. So I, it's, it's me trying to map out stuff. Uh, we definitely need to go more with these like orc god. And we also need some more evil type things. We need, we need a good balance between the two, I think. So I don't know how we'll, how we'll actually do it. It could be that satyrs are actually underneath the orc god. You know, like um, uh, a load of humans that he captured or something like that and wanted to change and then they escaped across or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. Something like that. Anyway. Random. Don't know. <laughs> don't know if that's that's of any use. It's completely different. Um so Green Raccoon's gotta go, we got homework. Man, what's with all this homework? You need to you need to get a job, man. That's that's what you need to do. Get a job. Get a goddamn job. Um obviously you might not be able to do it. 40 V's in the middle of class right now. Oh, fair enough. That does not sound good. You definitely want to be the orc god. Is that, is that what you're saying, Jim <laughs> Sand? Definitely, without, without doubt. <laughs> oh, dear. My nose. Ugh. Shooter's got mocks tomorrow. Oh, man. No, you've got, you've got to revise for your mocks. Um... School is one of those things. I played too much game, too many games when I was at school, uh, and I do regret it a little bit. However, I turned out fine, so maybe I'm not the best example. And I've got a good job. I haven't got a degree because I didn't actually do. I didn't go all the way through with a degree, but I've still got a very well-paid job, so I'm, I'm pretty happy. I think it's not really well-paid, but you know, it's pretty well-paid. You know, it's, it's it's well, it's enough, far enough to live off. You know. Um, Anyway, but yeah, definitely, definitely revise. It's worth doing. It'll reduce the stress of the whole thing. Uh, and trust me, when you do get a, a job in the real world, it it won't help at all those those exams. But <laughs> they could help you get that job like first without having to prove yourself. That's the that's the main. That's what I was trying to get at. There we go. So go revise, Shula. I'll make sure we we obviously obviously the video will be up anyway on on YouTube, so you can always watch it later. Uh, and there'll always be another one for you, Sheila. So, so do go revise. Do advise you to do that. What the hell am I talking about? I'm talking like a sensible kind of like <laughs> proper adult. <laughs> oh man, that's not good. What's changed? How how has this happened? I used to be like, nah, just just play games instead. Who cares about anything else? Um, John Smith, when I opened up your arrow in, in Conquest Three Forge, the latest version, there's block missing. Ah, don't open it up. Uh, you need to you need to run it through the world converter first, the 1.10 to 1.12 world converter. I still haven't, and this is this is my fault. I still haven't converted it and then re-uploaded it uh, at all. So it's in 1.10, which is why there's blocks missing. So you need to get the 1.12 uh, version of it. No, you don't need to get the version. You need to upgrade it. So you need to download it. Do not open it. Get the conquest world uh, converter. Uh, convert it over to. 1.12 version, and then from there, voila, you have now got it where you can use it. 
So um, yeah, it's, it's one of those things I, I probably need to put a, a like note on the Planet Minecraft. If I do remember it, I will. That's true, actually. Galadrax, you came up with a really good... Um, I, I was supposed to actually reply before I started the stream. I did read it. Um, but you came up with a really good, like, orc name. I'm going to use that for, like, like an orc chief or something. I can't remember what it was, though. Let me have a look in... What's it called? Good old Discord. Uh, wherever it is. Wherever it is. Where did I put it? Oh, it was General Law, wasn't it? Yeah, so Drax came up with, um... Dragorthak. What was it? The Emissary of Pain and Misery. <laughs> so I actually quite like that for an orc, orc kind of either an orc chief or just an orc dude, you know. Don't think I have an orc dude, can't we? Uh, right. Ah, maybe we'll have a cave, cave system under handbag. What we've got planned is we I'm not going to do like a, a load of caves under it because I think we won't ever finish it and I do want to finish this one I do want to get it uploaded even if that's the only thing I ever do um, let's get into that stage now where I'm just getting driven mad by it um, I mean, this is supposed to be a quick right this, when I started this goddamn town I don't know what's wrong with me right this, when I started this town this was supposed to be a quick easy build because I was like oh yeah well peasant houses they'll be they'll be nice and easy but I spend most of my time doing what I'm doing right now which is just Curving in roofs. <laughs> I mean, what the hell? I mean, yeah, it's not that easy. And plus, all the interiors as well. I mean, it's, and it's huge. Didn't really think about that, did I? Ugh. But yeah, we are going to have some. We are going to have some caves in order for them to. Um, it's to do with the whole storyline of when they were under Calandria. So Calandria, big ass empire. Um, they're actually they're actually quite French. The Calandrians. I've, I've decided. So I started to do a bit of the lore with um, how they all kind of started up, and they've got like a Fran Frenchy kind of like dynasty now, like of empires or emperors even. So we're going with quite French kind of stuff for it, and it. It's also a style that I've never even looked at, and well, not really, I've not looked at a style that I haven't actually done, um, except when I opened up. I think when I opened up Conquest the first time, I actually built like a Frenchy medieval thing, which kind of looked all right. Um, yeah, I think I did actually, didn't I? I don't know if anyone can remember that, but um, yeah, I did give that a go. That was quite, that was quite good. So we're, we're going to have the Calandrian Empire do that. They have built uh, the uh, local people around here when they were under, like being impressed. They built a cave from that house over there, that one right there, uh, which is one of the farmhouses. Right to the barrel maker, and then through the barrel maker, they would actually get people into the city. That's what we kind of like decided on in the end, which I quite like. I like an idea. Jax, Jax is a is a great name. Jacques, my name is Jacques. I am in Urk. <laughs> Prepare to die. You are going to be destroyed by me. I am Jacques. I am Jacques from France. Orc master. <laughs> can you can you imagine that? <laughs> oh, it's totally possible, you know. Actually, wait a minute. In in French, if you. Any French guys, if they've got any orcs, like, in TV series or something like that speaking, please post a link to that, because th there's got to have already existed, where somebody's doing, like, a a French accent with an orc voice, you know? Oh, you just make it really deep, I am an orc. You know, is it more like that? I don't know. Clandrian Empire looks a little bit smaller than already. It's been, well, it's been knocked back massively. Absolutely massively. Um, I was thinking about this the other day as well, and a lot of East Yarrowin, we haven't really got a lot of a storyline with it, and part of it was going to be that the Calandrian Empire didn't get to invade it, and that's part of their downfall. I'm now thinking, since we've got Byzantine, right? You know what I'm thinking with the whole Byzantine thing, now, if I've, now I've said it, and, and you know, with it being a, across the border and everything. I'm actually thinking of having the Byzantine kind of people being, they were part of the Calandrian Empire, and then they've broken off. Because it makes perfect sense, I know it's very much like the Roman Empire kind of thing, but then that kind of makes sense. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think that would be a good idea if we had it where the Calandrian Empire did expand into the east, uh, but they actually started losing, you know? They, they started getting taken over, and then you got the whole 
East and West Empire kind of splits. So you got the the kind of like homeland, which is which is what's left, um, and then you've got the rest of the whole whole stuff as well. Does that sound good? Sound good, man. How's it going, Minecraft zero eight? <laughs> Vader, more where's your brothel? I know we we haven't built one yet. I'm gonna build it in the. I'll show you actually after we've done this whole. Uh, detailing thing. I know this is a little bit boring, but I can talk for days while doing this. Um, I can talk to you guys for days while doing it as well, which is great. Right. Oh, I can't put anything down there. Oh. oh. I'll put that there. Um, yeah, I'll show you where it is in a bit. It's not... It's not. It's, I, I don't know if we're going to have the actual just rooms as just like normal rooms, or if we want to do something special. Uh, and the only brothel I've actually built is the one that we had in Mystic Pines. Do you guys remember that one? Maybe, maybe not. But it was like a, it was like an inn which had some rooms upstairs of questionable intent. Let's go with that. Jedi Productions, gotta go. Leave and do some maths. All right, man. Math is good. Math will help you. Um, probably the most useful thing. I, I thought math was. I, I sucked. I sucked at math, right? Probably the most useful thing that I've actually used out of all the kind of like things that you know, like science and uh, maths and English, is math. Honestly. From the most useful thing. Definitely. Uh, Roman Eagle just built a round Tudor style gun fort that was uh, built by Calandria. It fits the theme and their tech level. Absolutely. I think Calandria is probably going to be the most teched up out of everyone. Um, that and uh, Vestir is probably going to be pretty teched in terms of its in terms of its building of its castle. is probably going to be the most epic castle just because of where it is and the constant threat of like the orc invasion type thing and and all that kind of stuff kind of like ties in quite nicely with it being like this super kind of thing whereas down here they're all very square because they haven't been attacked as much so there's there's you know it's it's almost like they built some defenses but they've not really invested a lot of money in it instead they've invested in that money into uh well things like like beer uh obviously <laughs> oh Gardrax, you just you just wrote something really cool then. Sorry. Uh, so it's all flipping by quite fast on this on this new thing that I've got. So uh, Gardrax says Calandria, Calandria attempted to venture east, but only got as far as the Byzantine Pass before the hearts of the desert, the frost of the north, and mazes of the jungles. There we go. That sounds really good. All while Hemberg, and I can't see any more. Does it actually get cut off, or is there more? I don't know if it gets cut off on there. We got Storm Lindbergh. It's watching from Twitch. I'm doing good, man. How's it going? I know you've been streaming a lot lately. You've been streaming a hell of a lot, which is good. I've not been able to catch one of them yet, though. Mainly because uh, I think I've like been at work. But I did. I, I'm sure you did. You go live earlier? I can't remember. I'm even dreaming it. What was that? Someone else I saw go live earlier. I can't remember. I just randomly look at <laughs> Twitter. <laughs> and I just like stuff. That's the way of it. But yeah, it's doing good. Um, Definitely recommend Restream if you sort out the chat properly so it all goes into one place. It makes it so much easier than what I was doing yesterday while I was flipping through all of them. Uh, yeah. English is worth the ma worse than math. Well, you don't really... Well, actually, no, you do use it, sorry, yeah. I've made some... Uh, I'll, I'll be the first to admit that I have um, made quite a few spelling mistakes in my code, in my professional life. Uh, the good thing is that we, we've we now got this new policy at work where code has to be checked because, you know, previously we were just, like, there's me and this other guy to basically just do it. There's only two of us. Um, and we were just, like, hammering it because we had a ton of work to do. Um, and admittedly, our stuff did work, but occasionally it came across bugs. So now we've got this whole, like, code review thing, blah, blah, blah. And historically, there's been a couple of issues with uh, code not really, you know, it works in, like, 9 out of 10 times, but actually the... One time it doesn't work, you know, it's really bad or, or whatever, or caused an incident, you know, all that kind of crap. So we've got to do that now, and every goddamn time there is a spelling mistake. So actually, I probably should have paid more attention in English because it does, it's kind of useful. Even though it doesn't affect your code, it doesn't do anything, it just it just looks crap, you know, it makes you look like you, you bought your code <laughs> online from like somewhere, or copy and pasted it from like a Chinese website. I don't know, it has that kind of like feel to it. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the that's one thing that you should be aware of. But math's more important. It allows you to calculate things, and trust me, you will have to do it if you if you ever go into a Cody type thing. You'll you'll have to do it. Um, oh God, I had to do some maths and 
figure out I had to create a function to do some goddamn date time stuff and I'll never do it again. It's hideous. Anyway. Storm, don't think you went live today? That's fine. <laughs> I'm sure I'm sure I saw it. It might be that I that the feed that I was watching this morning when I woke up at five. I was just like looking through and it's from yesterday or something. I got I have no idea. Ah, how's it going, Genzong? Genzong says his wallet hurts. I uh, got Spider Man, R2 D2, uh, R2 RD Free 2. What the hell's RD Free 2? <laughs> okay. Uh, a year of PS Plus for PS4. Okay. God, it, it sounds like you basically just spent all your money, Genzong. It really does. Hey, Zarius, you're in the house, man. How's it going? I'm doing good. Turns out, Z, you can stream to five different places at once with Restream. So, I totally recommend it. <laughs> if, if you ever fancy doing it. Um, the only thing is with uh, Twitch, you can't you can't earn money on Twitch and stream to other places at the same time. They've got like an exclusive type thing. Which is fair enough. Totally fair enough. Ugh. Can't there be a village on the coast somewhere where it's been controlled by the orcs or a battle? I missed that. Damn it. It's flying past too fast, this chat. Let's see anything. Uh, controlled by the orcs where the battle was happening and then the clock stopped. Oh, I know what you mean. And the battle is, like, epic. I know what you mean. That would be pretty cool, actually. That would definitely be pretty cool. Because I know exactly what you mean. We can actually have a siege go... Oh! Oh, now you've got m me thinking. You have got me thinking. Because I was thinking, how do I portray, like, a proper orc war? Um, Vestia, all the way around oh, up here, is going to have a town like up on this north bit. Should we actually have the orcs like have landed, burnt the village here, and they're actually besieging a city? That would look so badass, wouldn't it? Ooh. Oh, Genzong, Red Dead Redemption 2. Ah, oh, of course. Not R2-D2. I was going to say, if you bought R2-D2, that would be pretty cool. <laughs> But yeah, Red Dead, Red Dead Redemption Two. I've I sips have started playing. I started watching it. But yeah, tell tell you what, man, we will definitely around this area right about here. Um, we'll actually do that. We'll have it actually literally under siege. Um, and have some like orc warships or something. That's whether like this. Well, this land we're going to have some orcs in it, won't we? Anyway, we can have some like proper orcs. So they could they could have even joined them. Maybe they have actually joined them. Gone down. But yeah, that is that is very that'd be very cool, wouldn't it? It'd be really badass. Um, and that would explain. Wait a minute, this actually works because you know we've got the signal fires lit as well, haven't we? If we, if we warp over there, yeah, I forgot about that. I was actually on that thing. Um, if we actually walk over there, let's go to Elduff Grove, for example. We do have. Oh my god, it's so laggy because I've just teleported in. Oh, and I'm on extreme as well. Should remember that actually, if you're on extreme and you do teleport, it's best to wait in the same place so that it deloads everything and then reloads. But yeah, all of these have been lit. So if all the if all the signal fires have been lit, right, which they have, that would make perfect sense. So that's that's why they're actually going to be marching out. Oh, that is a badass idea. That is a very badass idea, but um, that is going to be a pain in the ass. Shall I show you what I've, I've got planned for that area? Because it's been a very long time since I've been in there. I think I'm going to need to do game mode free. Because I have, and I'm not joking, I have actually put signs around as well. Look, I started doing this whole thing. You know? Fort, toll station, checkpoint thing. Whatever it is. I've got another signal tower up there. And I think we had another one all the way over there. So they, they actually do go across the mountains quite far. So go on there, then that one goes all the way over to this one. You know? Go right to there, signal tower, see? Uh, I don't know if I went any further. Uh, that would be a pretty good one for a signal tower, to be fair. It's very far away. I think that's probably why I didn't. I think that's when I stopped with the signal towers and went, okay, let's do something else. But this area up here somewhere? I'll find it. I find it. It's been. It has been a while since I've been here. That's snow. Okay. <laughs> there we go. I think I'm 
think it's around here. So this is where the castle was going to go. It was going to go on this crazy ridged kind of thing here. So we can actually like block all this bit up. And then the town was going to be down in the kind of like valley bit here. That's the plan. It's down there. So there's no reason why we couldn't have, you know... Oh, that's a perfect place for like a castle type thing, isn't it? Yeah, it's like nice and raised up and everything. So we're going to have quite a few forts here. Maybe even actually have that one has been taken over or something. Have it as if they are advancing all the way down. That would make, make it look really cool. Yeah, we're totally doing that. That sounds like a badass idea, guys. Really badass. Uh, and this is where we're going to have... Is this where we're going to have the little village thing? Yeah, this is the weird island kind of separated thing. So I was going to put like a little village type thing on here. And we'll have it completely burnt to the ground. Maybe even on these bits, like, have some proper, like, orc encampments, you know? That'd be very cool. And it'd make it look like the world is in motion, which is which is good. Anyway, back to Hemburg. Because that's what we're supposed to be doing. I'm not supposed to be distracting me. <laughs> oh, dear. Right, okay. So, back to what we were doing. Sorry, guys. Back to what we were doing. You guys are starting to talk about Star Wars, definitely. As I go in Niccolo Romano. Um, yeah, back where we were going around here, we will build some stuff, I think. Uh, we could probably do with some sort of warehouse around here. I kind of want the brewery to be, like, maybe we make it a little bit bigger or something. We have it going around a little bit more. But we could do with... Probably a warehouse up here for some some of the stuff. Like we got this nice little corner bit, and then we could do some houses around as well. We could do a couple peasanty type houses. Um, probably not opposite this one. We'll have a warehouse. Then we'll have some peasant houses going down here, kind of like we got around here. You know, we got like, these little or this little one, you know, this kind of thing. Little peasanty house, small like garden on the outside. Uh, we'll go with that kind of living um, where they are just working in the farms all day. And obviously, we've got a pig farm there, and they've got some shed fields with, apparently, legumes in it. Apparently they've got some legumes. Lovely. Um, Stitching Sand Place, what will be my big next big project after Hemburg? Oh man, I don't know. Do you think we'll finish it? <laughs> I mean, my, my next one was going to be Face to More, because it, it sounds kind of cool. Uh, I don't need to do follow, sorry. Oops. Because Face to More is about half the size, at least, which is this one here. So I was thinking, well, if I could do that, I could then, you know, join it up, do a little bit of Swampland type stuff, uh, and then maybe do some centaurs, because centaurs are weird. So that's what I was thinking. You know, separate it out a little bit. Do some of that. How's it going, Serenia Kapuchan? Round 13th, how's it going, man? Well, it's got Trill 10. Hey, Trill, how's it going, man? Sebastian Reichart. How's it going, man? Uh do some black market in some sort of some caves. I know I don't want to do too many caves at all because you, you get addicted with caves. Instead, all I'm going to do is have this cave that goes into there. That's the only one that I've got planned. Um, and that's it. It's high guard finished. That is laughable, sir. <laughs> I, qu I stopped doing high guard just so I could do this, which I thought was more manageable. And if I've not finished this, I've not finished high guard. Oh, man. But we will get onto high guard at some point. It's just, it is, that is a huge huge project. But yeah, I think... Right, let's do a, let's do some stuff. Let's get some materials. Yo, let's fly over there. And then we'll do some stuff for the time-lapse type stuff. Brothel was the next big build. <laughs> now, it'll be the Vader... It'll be the... It'll be the Vader Mall Brothel, or the, the Mall Brothel. <laughs> it'll be something like that. Gotta name it after you, man. Since you, you, you frequent it so much, you know? Uh, Z, shoot me a text when you free me. I will, man. I do. I do need to do that. I, I, it is on my mind. I need to grab you on Facebook again. I know I've got you on Facebook, so I will do that, man. Uh, but yeah, if you do stream Z, I definitely recommend using Restream just so you can go to different places. I mean, admittedly, I've got what four on Twitch, uh, fifty-four on YouTube, and zero on Mixer. So, mm, yeah. Uh, right, let's grab. 
So we'll use the mercury out that, do that, yeah, I'll do. Let's do an angled one. I haven't done an angled one for a little while. Actually, I haven't done an angled thing for a little while, so let's do that. And do it a little bit. Complicated. Um, the other thing I have been doing, guys, is I have been, um, as I get the chance, where are Wix is, there we go. Um, as I've been going on to, do, as I've been using brushes and things like that, I have been updating the website, so I have been starting to get them on brushes, and I have tied it into a Google Sheets, which makes it ten times easier. Um, oh yes, he might hewn stone. So all of these should be 1.12. Um, it's a, I'm still converting them over though. So yeah, if, if you want any of my brushes, then they're literally all there. Um, I'm just updating them as I go. There's some that I don't have, obviously, which like these, you know, the, the leaves and things like that, because they're just one leaf. So I've just used different leaves for different trees to, to like, you know, make it look different. Oh dear. Right. So. <laughs> can you do the brothel when it's open? Of course you can, Ark Arkham, even. <laughs> Ah, uh, right. Okay. I will Z. Sounds good. Right. Let's do another bit. Oh, that's really slow to close, wasn't it? Sebastian, where do I come from? UK, sir. UK. Of course you are. I believe you're German, aren't you? I believe so. So, yeah. Hmm. I'm just testing something and seeing if, yeah, so that's kind of worked. So I'm just checking. I'm checking the different feeds to see what they're actually like. Twitch for some reason reports on restream is zero, whereas I've got free viewers. So that's a bit bizarre, but all right, whatever. But it does seem like the chat's really quiet on Twitch, which which is fine. It should all come through to the same place. Skype is the best to call you on your mobile. If you, if you have a new number, cool. I will I will grab your number then, because I haven't been on Skype for eight. Well, actually, actually no. Z, I'll I'll send you my Skype. I'll send you. I'll be really bad and send you my work Skype, because <laughs> we actually use it at work. Well, ah, press the buttons. Uh, but I will do that. <laughs> I'll try and remember that tomorrow. All right. So if we go for Shula's technique, right, which was what was it? Something like this, wasn't it? Shula? I can't. Oh no, I've forgotten it. You thought I was Australian? I'm not Australian. That's that's about the best I can get for my Australian accent, by the way. You won't get better than that. <laughs> right, now I've got to remember what Shula taught me about the whole um, angled building thing. So I'm pretty sure it was like this, wasn't it? <laughs> John Smith, you converted Yarrow and it's all working awesome, man. I'm I'm surprised it happened that quick, but the tool is amazing. Um, like Java's usually a little bit on the slow side, generally. I mean, it's not always, but um, yeah, it's quite good though. Right, so if we had like, so now I've got to wait a minute. If we got, that's not the right angle. See that would be going in, right? 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 Oh, f who knows? Who knows which way it's going? I think it is, yeah, because then, yeah, because then this one has to go around. So if this one's there, then when you get this one, it needs to go back that way, doesn't it? Give me a second, I'm going to have a look at what I've done before. <laughs> How can I learn something and then forget about it? Because I went here, one, two, two, three, yeah. So this one was one, two. Our oh, vertical slabs have really made this a nightmare, haven't they? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, this is, this is not good. Right, okay, so if we had this here, right? Yeah, because then you go there. If I can figure this bit out, I can then burn it and uh, and just start again. Yeah, it did work. That is right. That is right. Ugh. Oh, do I know a good editing program? Uh, says students down place. 
I use Vegas, Sony Vegas. Um, but that's just because I've been using it for so long. I mean, there's also like stuff like Adobe has a really good one as well. I can't remember what it's called. What's it called? I've used that one before as well. That one's got some. That one's. If you get into the effects side of that, uh, the Adobe one is is amazing. Um, depends on what you really need. But yeah, free wise, I don't know if there's anything for free these days. I don't know any good ones. It's not like um, Photoshop where, you know, if you want a free version of Photoshop, you basically get GIMP, which always sounds really funny when when I say a GIMP because it just it sounds wrong. But um, it's it's really good, you know. <laughs> For, for what it is, it's really damn good for being free. But I don't know about that. Uh, George, when do we get back to mini games again? I was thinking about this the other day. I was honestly thinking about it because I've had quite a few new uh, donators. So I was actually thinking, you know, I should really do one. So I think we'll do one soon. Um, I've started to get ill, which is not ideal, obviously. But um, we could look at doing that at some point, you know, soon. If I'm if I'm not ill on the weekend. Potentially the weekend, but I'm not making any promises because I never know. Don't know what's going to happen, you know. So as long as I'm not ill, we can we can then do that. We can like do a couple hours or something. Depends. Do we want to do high pixel again? Or do we want to do that? Perhaps. Oh god, my nose is horrible. The thing is, I just woke up and I like started feeling ill. The thing is, I was, I was ill like a couple weeks ago. I never take time off work for it. I just end up just, you know, just dealing with it, but it's not really the best thing to do, but, you know, it's whatever. Show about what version am I on? So I'm playing on, um, it's 1.12, but it's, uh, it's modded. So it's modded Minecraft. It's a Conquest Reforged mod, which is really, really cool for medieval building. There we go. So I've got that there instead. Yeah. This is the only thing I've really struggled with, is the, is the roofs. Because <laughs> you got to, like, well, you got to do, like, this, haven't you? So you're not doing that kind of stuff, uh, and then we can just cut that out. We can put that in there. Uh, bit more great stream. Got to go. Time for the kids' bath, bed. Catch you later. No worries, man. Thank you very much for going on. So you suggested a brothel, but you've got kids. You sir are sick. <laughs> oh dear. Vader Mall. What's he doing? Wanted a brothel. <laughs> uh, to be fair, it would have actually it is it is something that you'd have in medieval times. Right. So if I remember correctly, I can do stuff. I do stuff like this, don't I? Oh man. Yeah, but then you come across these weird joiny bits. But we'll sort that out later. So if we do this. Yeah, yeah, then we get the central bit going across the middle. There we go, right. Figure it out in a bit. When in doubt, just place random blocks and hope that you know what you're doing. Yeah, that's the only thing. You always get this bit. But I guess you just go down onto the side on that one and then just leave it. I guess, I don't really know. I still have not got the knack for these tools. It's just, I mean, who knows who, who how to do like proper angled buildings? Not normal people, quite clearly. Yeah. So if we cut that off, that yeah, there we go. Quite clearly, it's not normal people. I quite like that actually. I quite like it without the bit there. See, it's all right if we look at it that way, <laughs> like an angle. Yeah, so we knock out that. Oops, not that one. Knock out that one. Obviously, that doesn't go there then. Ah, there we go. So that's how it works. Right, so we have that there. So it's got a stair there, and yeah, we got a stair there. So that that is it, right? Oh man. Oh dear. Gabriel Beamish, Shay, how's it going, man? Uh, so Gabriel says, um, "Glad to see, glad to be able to catch the stream. First one you've seen since I've been able to take a break. What was that for? If you don't mind me asking, I don't mind you asking at all, not at all. Um, so work was really heavy, really, really heavy. Um, just in terms of the kind of like stuff that I was doing, as well as 
wasn't just the stuff that I was doing, it was the amount of work that we had coming in was just ridiculous. Um, so it just it just burnt, burnt me out. You know, I, I had I was doing so much, like, I was doing extra time, I was just, I was working my ass off. Um, so there was that, and I just didn't have enough energy to do streaming. Um, so I think I kind of burnt myself out a little bit by doing too much streaming and doing too much Minecraft type stuff as well. Because uh, there's always this thing with, with YouTube, and YouTubers will know it. Um, you always want to have videos like going up, almost like like you want to have them every day. You want to have a video every day, and if you start doing that for a number of years, you you kind of like you feel like you're letting people down if you don't. So you end up pushing yourself, and that's that is what I was doing as well. So I was like having a lot of work coming in, you know, coming home, and I was going right, let's cook cook something really quick for me and my partner, and then I'd, I'd be on streaming or I'd be doing. Uh, making a video or doing something like that, and it, it just burnt me out. It totally burnt me out. Um, so yeah, it's one of it's one of the things you just got to be really careful about is uh, it's making sure you don't do that. So that, that's that's kind of like what happened, uh, if I'm honest. I'd rather be honest because otherwise, um, well, I don't see any point not. You know, it's okay to be completely dead from work. <laughs> and to be fair, you know, my my like obviously professional job, it's it's a lot more. Uh, obviously, it makes a lot more money than YouTube, so I, I you know, I had to drop, you know, it, it was between those two, I've, you know, I've just got to drop, drop YouTube because uh, I don't make enough money from it. Just fair enough. Uh, sorry, guys. I'm gonna have to probably blow my nose in a minute, so I'll like pause it and stop, and then come back. <laughs> uh, it's horrible. Absolutely horrible. I hate being ill. Absolutely hate it. There's nothing worse than being like feeling ill anyway. I think. Alright. Especially, right, when I wanted to do quite a nice long stream today. <laughs> I, like, I was like, ah, oh, right, I can like, chill out a bit. I've got quite a relaxed day-ish. You know, it's Monday, so... Monday, surprisingly, at, at my work is actually more relaxed than any other day. It seems to be, anyway. Hey, thank you very much, for Joker, for subscribing. Um, so, yeah, it seems like the most relaxed day for me. Not that it doesn't mean it actually is, but it just it has this weird feel about it. I think it's because um, I try and finish up stuff for uh, uh, like like we have like a load of change control type things going on in in work, so you have to like do do proper change control and all that kind of crap. So I usually get them all in by Friday. So then all I've got to do is like apply a bit of code on um, on the Monday or Tuesday. Usually Tuesday actually. It's usually Tuesday because they meet on Monday. So um, yeah, it's that kind of stuff. So I always feel a little bit more relaxed, but um, not always. It just usually is. So I was like, oh, I'll do some, I'll do some streaming tonight today. Then I woke up and I got this like stinking cold, and it's like, ugh. All right, where did that come from? I didn't want that. <laughs> not they can, you can't do much about it, though, can you? You know, there's no what you can do about it. Anyway. Right, fair enough. It's uh, hard balancing a career with YouTube. Sorry, I just missed a message as well. Um, just glad you're feeling better about it. Yeah, it's one of those things that you. It's. It's really weird. Um, unless you've done YouTube, you don't really understand, the kind of pressure that you put yourself under. It's it's so bizarre because it's not like coming from someone that's coming from subscribers like saying, "Can you do X, Y, Z?" You know, and and you feel some pressure from that. But some of it's just from yourself. You know, just to keep putting up videos and keep doing stuff. It's weird. Really weird, in fact. Best way is. Alright. So anyway, let's finish this bit up. All I can hear outside at the minute as well is fireworks. Is anyone doing anything for fireworks night? Because it is fireworks night. Which I didn't really remember about. Way. Holy shit! Smurf Masher, thank you so much, man. <laughs> Could you tell us subscribe like surprised on that? Jesus. Smurf Masher, thank you honestly dude. Thank you so so much. That's so nice of you, that is freaking incredible incredible. Oh. oh that's going on the high score, I think. I've started to put all of them on uh, like donations on uh, my bout page. I need to update it, actually. But yeah, Smurf Mashers, thank you so much, dude. That is amazing. Jesus. Jeez. I just realised I haven't got a goddamn entrance. Oh, Smurf Masher, by the way, I have actually started um, streaming on Mixer. 
So I do need to have a chat with you because I know you. I know you said that you've got some stuff on the mixer, haven't you? Like a, a collaboration or channel or something like that. So I definitely need to have a chat with you um, off stream to see if we want to do anything, and then then um, I can host you guys as well when I'm not streaming. So I might want to build some, do some stuff on mixer, just to just to see what it's like, really. Um, but I do need to have a chat with you about that. The only reason I actually knew about it is actually from you, by the way, um, Smurf. As weird as that is. <laughs> love you, sen love you, Dubai sends his love. He always sends his love. Every day and twice on Sundays he sends his love. Oh, I do miss Lovey. That's funny. <laughs> it's a really nice chap. <laughs> uh, sometimes he was just just too much, wasn't he? Just too much loving. Yeah. Hey, how's it going, Rex? Stop. Thank you for stopping by, man. It really does mean a lot. <laughs> the orcs just want to visit the brothels. I'm sure they do. I'm so sure they do. All the time. Ugh, my nose. Uh, dying. Right, okay, so we've just done... Oh, it's not that bad, is it? You know. I think it just needs a bit more. It looks a bit too clean, and that's not always the best thing. Yeah. Trapdoor time. Not those stairs. Even though I love those stairs, but no. If we do like that, there we go. It's a little bit lumpy and, and kind of a bit crappy. That's what we want. Ah. What was changing from Vanilla to Conquest like? Um, I think there's a video of me actually doing it when when I, I it's when I was watching Jamsy Boy. So it's quite a while ago now. But yeah, I was watching Jamsy Boy, um, and he actually switched over. And I, at first, I was like, "No, nah, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it." And then I actually tried out Conquest like quite a bit, and I was like, I I got into the metadata stuff, which was really difficult to get into. There's like a whole load of videos on me playing um, or building like Riverwood, and a lot of those have got like me trying to like figuring out how to do it with like world edit and stuff like that without using the meta cycler. And my God, did the meta cycler make your life better? Um, Van did a hell of a good job of making that tool. That was it. Just without that, I don't think it would have hit off honestly. So I know me and Ravan have had our differences, but I've got to give him props, you know, where props is due. Um, but yeah, it was it was really difficult, really really difficult. It's totally different than uh, than vanilla building. Not saying there's anything wrong with vanilla building. You can actually do quite a lot with vanilla building. Actually, I've seen some pretty cool stuff going on, um, and there always has been. And actually, sometimes they're more creative, I think. But it wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad switching over. Um, I'd definitely do it again. You know, like, that doesn't look too bad. It looks more like a house than a, a like a warehouse, though, doesn't it? But we could have this as like a little place where they have like their, they still a cart or something like that and um, things of that nature. At least it's an angle, which is good. <laughs> Harry Cole Morgan, I'm going to start making longbows or just leave that for a certain someone. Oh man, I wish I could make my own longbow. I'm not joking. I'm quite into like the survival type stuff, um, so. Me and my other half have been building like bug out bags and things like that. So I have been looking at bows, and literally I had the same thought as you. I was like, "Wait a minute, I'm doing conquest stuff, and I'm thinking about bows." And it's, it's, my first thought was of Jamsy Boy. It was absolutely of Jamsy Boy. It's weird, and that's when I decided no. <laughs> but I did think about like like should I actually have? Should I actually get like one of those like uh, a, a proper? Like uh, Hawkeye type one, you know, one that I can like flick out of a bag or something. And I was thinking, actually, do I need that in my survival pack? Really? I guess so, because in the UK we don't have any, you know, weapons as such. So, but potentially. But yeah, I did. I did think it's very weird. So I don't know, but I still think Jamsy Boy. It's a shame. Like I, I, I'd kind of like like him to come back at some point. It'd be really nice if he did. So I'm sure he's still around somewhere. You know. But it's one of those things again, you know. It, it's a uh, there's a huge amount of effort that you have to put into YouTube to to get stuff out of it. So there's there's that side as well, which is uh, 
bit that don't people people don't really think about um, it's the whole planning planning for the rest of your life and stuff there's a lot of sacrifice in it I, I think as well so yeah well, random random conversation Gabriel Beamish, is this a barn or a home? I know, it's debatable. Totally debatable. Definitely. The Joker, if this was Skyrim, I'd play it. Ah, oh, so would I, man. Smurf Masher, definitely hit me on Discord, man. We'll we'll sort some stuff out for, for Mixer. Um, I have no idea how Mixer works. I even, yesterday when I was streaming, I struggled to even find my own Mixer channel. <laughs> That's why, that's why when I tweeted it, I put the link on there so I never lose it. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I, I seriously struggled to find it, so any advice on Mixer and all that kind of stuff, and we can, uh, like, I can definitely want to be, like, hosting some people on there as well. Same with Twitch, actually. I was thinking about this the other day. I was thinking about Twitch. Like, host some other, like, Minecraft um, conquesty type channels when I'm not actually streaming. So I was thinking about that. Z, you're off to go and download the Fallout 76 patch. Oh. Oh, man. That'd be so good. That'd be so good. you got to do that. Fallout 76, I haven't got it yet. And I'm I'm looking at it going, if I do it, I'm going to spend so much time on that game. And I, I just know I'm going to lose most of my life to that game. Anyway. How's it going, Nicky Learn? Sorry if I'm missing people, by the way. Um, it's a bit of a nightmare. To, to keep up with the streams and uh, not really the streams, keep up with everything going on. I want a tree there. I have decided a tree will go there. Right, so let's plonk this down. Tree. Apparently spelt really poorly with three R's and two E's. Well, it's got normally got two E's. It's just got. It's not got three R's. I thought I had three R's. It's got two R's. I can't read. Damn it. Okay. Right. I'm just going to blow my nose, so I'm going to pause the mic. Sorry, guys. Uh, right, okay, so <laughs> that, that's me back. Oh, God, it's horrible. Absolutely horrible. Um, okay. Harry says uh, he popped your meta cherry. Yep, definitely. Hopefully he'll come back at some point. You never know, he could do... He could come back, do some videos, and just disappear again. You know, you never know. Depends if he wants to get back into it. It's one of those things, Minecraft, you kind of... If you do Minecraft, you have to play Minecraft. Um, that's pretty much it. I don't know. Ugh. Talico, am I working on that troll cave? I'm not. No, I'm not working on a troll cave at the minute. Just doing some, uh, doing some stuff. Yeah, we, we built this, which is, uh, kind of like, it's supposed to be a barn. I think it's going to be someone's house. I honestly think this is going to end up being someone's house. Just it's, it's nice and small doesn't really look that barn shaped so I mean we could have this as someone's house they could have a couple like bits and bobs around the outside or something I think we'll do it as a house yeah uh, the Joker would you rather play Minecraft that's like Skyrim or Skyrim that's like Minecraft um I think Minecraft that's like Skyrim I think because it would have that kind of like good feel about it do you know what I mean yeah Harry doesn't have world edits, so I've been flying around uh, for at least the last half an hour trying to find a good biome to make a village. I totally feel you, man, because I, uh, what I ended up doing instead, I've got like the pocket edition of Minecraft. So when I'm like sat on the sofa, I was just like pl like building something, just like putting down some ideas. I did the exact same thing. I just flew around ages forever, like really, looking for a place to build. So I ended up having to uh, just going onto a site and finding some, I want some mountains. So um, I found one that had some like pretty extreme mountains and just went with that. <clears throat> Come on, my voice just broke then. Yeah, I just went with that. Which is fine. It kind of worked. But yeah, totally, totally understand where you're coming from. 
It's one of those things. Uh, let's put that up there. How's it going to play Raven? Can I do a new Let's Build series? It's one of those things that... I'll, I'll show you what I want to... Uh, I, I need to continue with this. I did start, obviously, doing the... Ooh, here we go. Fly over here. I did start doing the castle. Um, so we need to finish the castle at some point. Definitely. Here we go. I quite I really like that when you come to see it and you see the arches. I know it's not finished yet, but when it gets finished, it'll look really good. So we need to finish the castle. Um, and I do want to finish... Silver Sage as well as the other one, actually. Which is, um, for you guys that don't remember, is this one down here. Right, works. There you go. So this is Silver Sage. I do want to finish Silver Sage, and I don't think we've got that much to do, really. Because, you know, we finished, we did the inn the other time, which we did on stream, which I love this inn. I really do, and I need to tutorial it, really. But I absolutely love the inn. Absolutely love it. I think it's great. Especially with the dog and it's like a little water thing and it's the the drunken dog. Yeah, drunken dog in. And then it's got some rooms upstairs. I absolutely love it. So I think we need to like, you know, complete this. Do a couple of houses. Just need a couple of houses on there. Uh, finish up the beach because I started smoothing it out like this. <laughs> yeah, I started smoothing it out like this and making it look really good. And then, oh no, this text just changed. I hate it now. Do you know if they've got any, like, plans to, like, finish, like, you know, change the texture back to what it looks like in the damn picture? I just don't like it. I just don't like this this texture at all. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Um, so, yeah, I do, do want to finish this off. And I think it's only a couple of buildings. Um, I've got the footage of the timelapse when we did that one. So, do that. Put in a couple of houses. Um, we need to put in a windmill, I think I was going to put there. Something like that. I was going to put a windmill up there. Yeah, put up a windmill there. Probably do a couple more fields as well. Um, going to have a couple stumps of wood around somewhere. And we're going to put the Lord's residence up there. Well, not really the Lord. The Baron or Baronet or whatever, you know. Yeah. So we'll see that. Get his face sawn off in this place. Should be not so good. Not so good at all, really. Um, oh, no, that's fine. I didn't didn't break anything. I thought I broke something then. Just looking at this and going, It'd be nicer if they were down like that. Maybe there's a reason I did that, or maybe not. Hmm. Maybe there was a reason I did it. Maybe it's just because it looks a little bit more float. No, it doesn't. It doesn't look flowy at all. What I'm talking about? I'm talking madness. So yeah, well, I mean, we'll have a look at that. Will I ever do a modern city? I've not, I've not been... I've just not got into modern again. There's not... I'm not really feeling the drive for it, because it's just so big. You know? That's the problem. It's just too big. But yeah, right. Back to... Back to Hamburg, anyway. So... Where is it? There we go. Need to finish this area as well. <laughs> so I keep on teleporting into it, and I'm like, oh, it's a blank. And this bit, we need to finish this bit around here, and around there, and there. There as well, we need to finish that bit. God, there's so much we need to finish. But no, we'll get there eventually. Roman Eagle going for dinner. Probably back soon, fair enough. Right. Uh, so, I think we build some sort of warehouse here where they obviously brew all the stuff and they barrel it. So, we'll have like something around here. We could do with, we can almost do with having like, or, or we can have it like the, the thing around there or around there for this. Like, almost do with like walling up the brewery a little bit. I think we'll wall up the brewery. Yeah. Yeah, wall at the brewery. So I'm just going back to the menu so I can uh, do everything else. Whitewash the castle. I don't want to whitewash the castle. I don't. L I don't like them as much. I will do it at some point, definitely. But I don't know. I like. I like the kind of like stone bricky castles. I know it's not the same. No, they would. But what? I, 
what I want to do with the castles is have like um, stone on the bottom and then potentially have that kind of like Tudor type whitewashed uh, kind of like walls as like rampart type things. I don't know. Something like that. What do I want to think about in the new Battlefield game? I haven't played it. I've, I've um, had Battlefield 4. I played that for a little bit. Got my ass kicked so many times on that game. Um, and I kind of like just stopped. I didn't really get to play it anymore. <laughs> I'm just not good at those type of games, but um, it's one of those, isn't it? It's one of those you have to, you have to play it loads to get into it, you know. Right, so I think I think we'll have a. All right, we got this like wall going around it, right, and then they walk around. Okay, so we can actually have around the back. No, I think they could actually have some stuff for the river as well. What's this thing here? What's this? Mill. Okay. Hmm, I don't know. What's wrong with my bitrate? Is it a bit laggy, is it? Hopefully it shouldn't be. Should be getting 4,560 kilobytes a second, apparently, according to the stream monitor. Uh, apparently that's what you should be getting. Don't ask. Um, will I do a walk around of some of the finished settlements, or when others are finished? Absolutely, yeah. So, the Wagrandale is the only one that I've really finished and done a video on. Um, but that has got the YouTube 360 kind of thing going on. Um, I think what we do. So I'm just having a look at this. Yeah, because we're gonna have a mill there, won't we? I think we're actually gonna use this to mark out where we're gonna have gonna have like a little dock type thing around here. Dock. Because it makes perfect sense to have something there. Um, yes, yeah, so we'll have a dock around there. That means we'll have the... If we have the... Because obviously it's just like a load of empty area. We'll have the barn around here, or the, the storage place, I think. It's quite close to the water's edge, though, isn't it? A little bit. But all of it is, so it's fine. Absolutely fine. But yeah, we'll do something like that. There you go. Make it nice and simple. You don't need anything like massive, do you? That's why they would store some of it in here. Uh, and probably see that's like more nice and whitewashed, isn't it? Let's get the kind of like hewn stone that we've been using a lot. I don't know why I've gone with that for the actual style of the like buildings and everything like that, but you know, who knows? Um, we could actually. Make it like more like that, so it actually goes around in the corner. You know, do like something a little bit different. Neo goes away, makes himself a tea, and I'm like rich. I know. Smurf Masher just absolutely smashed my mind with his donation. Absolutely smashed it. That's like, I think that's the biggest single donation I've ever had. So I think he's totally beasted it, if you know what I mean. I'm just going to go with this. I'm going to stick this one out a bit. No, uh, I can still have that going across there, it's just... Just like your first day back um, to school, and Jesus, GCSEs are not fun. Yeah, they're alright. <laughs> I, I can say that, because I've done it. <laughs> but, yeah, they're alright. They're not too bad. You know? Could be worse. I mean, the thing is about your GCSEs, um, once you're done with them, you are done with them, you know? You'll be free. Once you're free, well, they can do whatever you want. College is good. College is really good. Um, and quite enjoyable. So you get to choose what you want to do. Just make sure that um, you. I would definitely recommend getting a job while you're at like college or, or things like that, because it will get you get you more used to like planning your time a little bit better. I'm not joking. I, it sounds really weird, but um, and also the extra money is really good. So it'll allow you to like you know plan your time a little bit better. Uh, make sure you do your coursework as well because you'll actually be able to do that better if you actually have a job because you'll have to have to do it. Whereas if you don't have a job, the first thing you think is, oh, I don't need to worry about that, it's like in two weeks or it's in three weeks and then you never do it. But if you have a job, you for some reason end up doing it. 
I don't know why. <laughs> I think it's because you, you have like that gap between it. So, totally get a job. Get a job. Get the money. Maybe. Oh, yeah. But apart from that, was it alright? You know? Was it just was it just that it's like, uh again? Because there, there is always that bit of school where you just go, uh um, can you donate without a credit card or just your bank or something? Yeah, you can use the... If you use the Streamlabs one, you can use the... There should be like a PayPal type option. I think there's a couple options on Streamlabs. They've they've like set it up and it's pretty good. So feel free to use that if you want to. It'd be amazing. Right, let's go for something like this. It's good to be building again, actually. With like <laughs> actual structures. <laughs> Which I know sounds really weird. Hey, do random games. Thank you very much for subscribing, man. What sort of job? Like McDonald's job or proper company job? Um, I would not go... Well, if you can get a proper job, company job, brilliant. Like for your career-wise, that will instantly look great. Um, I started in a shop. I did I did Saturday hours. So I was working in Fat Face. And I ended up working in there for about five years, I think. Um, including part... Almost like full-time. So, you know. It's, it was a really good job. Really good experience. Is it a career for life? No. And the the thing is, I knew that it wasn't a career for life, which is is a good thing, because then you don't feel like you're stuck there, like you don't want to leave. So something like McDonald's, something like um, just anything that gives you responsibility is quite good. Um, McDonald's are actually really good employers. I'm not, I'm not joking; they're actually really good employers. For everything that I've heard about them is absolutely brilliant. So I'm not gonna gonna knock them. I know everybody like takes the mick out of them um, sometimes, but there's nothing wrong with them. <laughs> Yeah. Not at all, Skip. I, I totally appreciate any donations at all, man. Um, all of them, I like. I actually do note down every single person that donates and how much they've donated over time. Um, not because I'm like, can I keep track or anything like that. It's just that then I can like, you know, if, if something was coming up and somebody wanted, I don't know, was it like a, uh, I don't know, we did some sort of like meetup or something like that. I don't know, like put certain people first. That's the plan, but apart from that, it doesn't really matter. I'm, I'm like really grateful, you know, because you wouldn't get it like normally, would you? Do you know what I mean? So, anyway, but yeah, uh, jobs are really good. I would, I would advise working in a shop only because I've done it, so I can tell you that it's pretty good. Um, it's just, you, yeah, it's really difficult to kind of like move upwards because you, you've always got the older people that will always have been there for a long, long time, and uh, they will always get the jobs over you because you know and just they just do but you know if you can do stuff where you're doing customer service customer service is just universal with pretty much anything you do I mean I, I work in a like back office where I'm pretty much just writing code but I, I do occasionally do uh, like presentations and things for people that are you know get paid about ten times as much as I do <laughs> but apparently <laughs> like customer service is one of those things that you would just if you learn it if, if you have it and you've got the experience it's great you can always draw on it you know, um, and the other thing is, with clothes, if you're working in a clothes shop, you get discount on those clothes. And trust me, when you're like in college or in or whatever like that, university, you are skint. You are just completely skint. So, having a discount on clothes is brilliant. <laughs> I've got, I've still got jeans from back in those days, and that's been like 12 years, I think, maybe. Guys, it's been 12 years. Crap, I'm getting old. Um, <laughs> but I think it has been quite a while <laughs> since those days. So, I don't know. And from everything, I come back and try on credit card. Not possible without internet banking, like, idea. I don't know. I've never tried it out, man. Um, I'll check it out at some point. But, yeah. Don't worry about it. I'm, I'm totally happy. So, but thank you very much. I, I'll have a look at um, if there's any other ways I can do it, which is quite nice and easy. I've thought about Patreon as well. So, Patreon, I think, gives you a load of different options. And that's some, that's some way that people do it. Um, I'm still actually um, still uh, donating to Darwin Reforged. I haven't been on there in ages, but I feel that I'm doing my part for it. <laughs> and I keep on forgetting, but I should really go on. Do you know what I mean? It's one of those things. Not that it actually matters anyway. But, um, I don't know. So yeah, go on, go on, go on Darwin Reforged because I'm paying for it. How about that? Like my five five pounds or something like that a month. Let's go check it out. Go and use my money. Because I've forgotten to use it. <laughs> Andrew, anyone seen Rogue One? I think everyone has. 
surely everyone has. I freaking love that movie. In my mind, best Star Wars movie yet. And that is from somebody that's been watching, or has been a fan of Star Wars for a really long time. Really, really long time, but absolutely fantastic movie. Absolutely brilliant. Um, Trill, did I try your, your version 8 shaders? I did. I have indeed. I've been playing around with them. I want to get it a little bit brighter, because I know they're less saturated than your other ones. I have tried them out a couple times, and yet again, I have been playing around with them. They are really nice, though. They are really, really nice. I was going to post some pictures, actually, um, of them at some point. The only problem I've got is because I've started doing... Or I've got footage of like time lapses with um, the version, version 7 ones. I don't want to then switch shaders halfway through, because I think it would look weird on a time lapse. But, um, yeah, I have been looking at those, and I'm probably going to switch over to them once I, like, tweak it to try and get that kind of... I don't know what look I, I, I like. I have no idea what it is, but um, whatever it is that I like. But I like the water. Water looks great. Uh, the underwater looks great. Um, and I really like that you've got the contrast and brightness options in there. Those are really great, good. And yes, I am saying brighter. I think that's probably because I've turned it darker to make a little bit more contrast. <laughs> I think I've turned the contrast up so it's gone darker, but now I want to make it a tiny bit brighter. You know what it's like with goddamn settings? You end up doing it. Doing like the same thing over and over again, and it ends up being the original settings. And you just think that you've played around with it for ages, but actually it's just default. So yeah. But no, it, is, it does look really good. It did really, really good. So I think I will switch to them uh, once I've done some tweaks. The only thing I found though with them, which is really weird, when you do take a screenshot with the version 8 ones, the screenshot looks really dark, and I don't get why. I've not figured that out yet. So I think that's something like, I don't know if it's just my, my computer when it renders it, because it's like, it's not dark when, um, uh, when I've actually got them on. So it's just bizarre. Ah, oh, Drax, you, if, if you can get past the flat characters of Rogue One, is really by the best, by, by, uh, best, by far the best movie. There we go. God, I'm really struggling to, with the words, you know? Them words I'm not doing very well with. Anyway, so have I convinced anyone to um, work in a shop or anything like that now? That's the main thing. Am I, is it like DACA career advice? <laughs> Good, wouldn't it? Be really weird, really bizarre. Uh, right. Uh, Tony's been used for some sort of project, uh, or just like building for building's sake. Um, no, it's just it's just building because I fancy, well, not really fancy building. I just like building stuff. Um, it'll be uploaded and stuff like that, so it'll be on like Planet Minecraft. But um, there's no like special project or anything like that. It's just uh. It's just I wanted to build stuff, uh, as I always have. You know, I started doing, you know, the Isles of, um, Isles of Dacross did that, and I, I quite liked doing that, but I wanted to do, like, a world that was bigger, which I think was my downfall, but, um, bigger that, uh, kind of, like, had more character to it, and more story, and, uh, so it's kind of, like, all tied into that. I really, I like the story side of it, it's, I think it's great. Come up with some really cool stuff, and you guys have helped so much with that. GPA you got 5 to 20 uh, FPS with Conquest Reforged. Damn, really? That sucks. What have I got? I've got... I can't see. It's behind my record button. Is there any way... <laughs> is there any way to see it properly? At all? Without... Without the record button being in the way? Oh, man. I have no idea what I've got. Because I can't see it anywhere else. I think it's like... 300? Maybe. I'm going to go guess with 300. I know that when I've got no shaders on, it's really, really quick. Um, as soon as I put shaders on, then it, it does go down a bit, but it's not too bad. How to improve FPS? I don't have no idea. Ah. How are you found the right biome? Awesome, man. Make sure each house has its own little barn so they can have fresh milk and eggs in the morning. Ah, oh, that's a really nice idea, actually. That's a really nice idea. A bit different, isn't it? Right, I think we go with doing like an archy type thing or um thing, whatever. I think up here. 
Yeah, if we go like, oh, for God's sake, don't delete stuff. Ugh. That looks weird. Okay, that looks a little bit weird, but whatever. If we go with building up those sides there, so we get that kind of like really tall, really weird looking. Oh, this looks horrible. What have I done? I know what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to make it look a little bit like it had like a little... That's better. That's much better. There we go. I knew what I was trying to do. So 360, so 360, yeah, I think so. It's gonna, be, it's gotta be something like that, right? Gotta be. Oh yeah, I can't put anything there. Oh well, that's fine. So this one like this, and um, do this one on this side. Put that down there. Here we go. That looks weird. <laughs> I think it's because the door is just like on that weird side bit, so let's not do that. Ugh. Radioactive gaming. Why were you not notified of this immediately? I don't know. I don't know. Sometimes YouTube does play up if you if you do it on YouTube. Um But you should have got my tweet. So I did tweet it. Tweet it. Well actually I didn't tweet it. Restream tweeted it for me. How lazy am I? Super lazy is the answer. Um, I cannot praise Restream enough, really. <laughs> Making my life really like lazy. Except that one of them didn't work, which is Periscope. No, Smashcraft was a not able to connect, but the chat was able to connect. So I have no idea if I've got anyone watching on Periscope. I, I doubt it, since I didn't even know what Periscope was until today. Is that bad, though, guys? You know... It's bad that I didn't know what Smashcraft was and I didn't know what um, Periscope was. The only ones that I knew about was obviously YouTube being like a, having its own stream and stuff because obviously I've used it. Twitch, everybody knows Twitch. Twitch is like the king, I think, of uh, of live streaming. Uh, and also uh, Mixer because Smashcraft told me about it. Not Smashcraft. Ah, not Smash. Smurf Masher. There we go. That's why I was getting com confused. Smurf Masher told me about that. Oh yeah, it helps if I. Mass the right block. There you go. So yeah, anyone else know about anything else? Got a guy from South Africa. Love the accent from South Africa. It's one of those ones that um, when you first hear it, you go, God, is that Australian? No, it's not Australian. And it's really bizarre. Because <laughs> it's really not like Australian. <laughs> but that's seriously what we think. It's, it's so weird. But, I don't know. It's a very good, very cool thing. Very cool accent. Oh, right. Bros, yeah, gotta go. No worries, man. Thank you very much for coming on. I do appreciate it. Don't ask why I'm filling in the floor on this with by hand as well. But that's just what I'm doing. Okay, so I run an up and coming on my mobile RPG using. Uh, Conquers Reforged, massive project. Open to having a chat with the entire world of Dungeons of Dragons. Oh man, that sounds good. Um, on my Discord, by the way, Tony, you can post in promotion. So if you've got um, your own Discord or uh, videos or anything to do with it, feel free to use the promotion channel and post it. That's what it's there for. So um, it's literally, it is literally there for stuff like that. You know, projects that people are working on that um, which is quite interesting. You know? Oh dear. Andrew, can I make tutorials again? Depends what depends what ones they are. I'm gonna do some more medieval stuff again. Um I am planning on tutoring the entire entirety of Hemburg. That is in, in default. Uh and then at some point what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab all those in white um and going to go into like uh, like the world, just like a normal default world. And I'm actually going to pl plop them around and just try and see what we can come up with and do like a nice video on that. Let's see if we can get them all to fit in. Um, but yeah, zombie stuff. I have no idea. I mean, what would you do for zombie must stuff? I know there's some really 
There's some really good maps on um, Planet Minecraft for zombie stuff. So I would recommend checking that out. Right. Uh, getting me onto the on the team is like impossible just because of work. Um, it's just impossible for me to do it, literally because of work. Because I I never know. Well, it's not like I never know what I'm doing at work. Like I've got a pretty steady um, like hours and things like that. It's just that sometimes it'll just get be killer, you know. Really will. I'll just be doing stuff. Like the minute we're quite lucky because um, certain things have been delayed, which makes it. Oh, it's really good. So that means we can sort out some of the stuff that we've been writing, rather than it just being really quick. But yeah, it's one of those things. All right. I don't even notice this bit on the inside. There's this bigger. I'll look at the roof. But yeah, this could be quite cool. Put some windows on it or something later on. And sort something out, I think. Alright. Bro, yeah, thanks. No YouTubers ever notice any comments, don't they? Really? That's the kind of thing that I like about streaming. I think that's the main thing about streaming is that you should be interactive with comments. I think it's a bit difficult. It depends on what kind of like channel you are. If you like Minecraft or something like that, you can stop. Um, if you're doing like an FPS type game, then you can't. So I can kind of understand it for some of them, you know? I think it makes makes sense, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Right. That's looking good on that bit. Alright, let's do this stupid roof thing. I always end up doing like the same kind of thing with things with these roofs, because there's not really too much you can vary on them. You can kind of put like something there, and you can do something around here, but really it just ends up being like the same, which is fine. Ah, uh, setup tour video, um, pretty much. I've got two monitors. Uh, I've got a keyboard and a mouse. <laughs> that's, that's normal people. And uh, I've got a pretty beefy PC, even though it's like five years old now. It's still beefy, which has got 64 gigs of RAM. Um, I've got a mixing desk, which um, is actually like a proper audio mixing desk. Because I, I, I'm actually, my, my training is actually in uh, sound engineering, so, and it's something I don't do anything like it in my job. Uh, like an actual real career, but um, yeah, I'm actually a, a, a trained, qualified sound engineer. But um, so I do have like nice mixing desk, a little bit of a mic, and that's it. There's nothing else. Uh, so I've, that's why I've never done like a, a, a setup video because I don't think there's really anything to set up. Thank you very much, um, Reconsole24 for subscribing. Thank you very much. Do we have any other bits that are sticking out? No? Okay. It's just that bit there. Cool. Shove that in. Oh, the link in the description says it's invalid. You should be able to copy it somewhere. I'm sure that's happened before. Like, the, the link gets, like, corrupted or something every so often. So I might refresh it. But I have had it before with that link. Um, the one that's in the description for the Discord. But yeah, it should be, you should be able to. Um, there we go. If I grab it, I'll show you how you do it, because I, I can't quite remember. I might get some weird feedback, hopefully not. Let's have a look, right. Uh, uh, there we go, Discord. You can. God, I haven't done this for a while, have I? I can tell. Yeah, you click on that one. Then you can join, then you can paste it, and then you can join. That's what you can do. That's how you do it, right? Click that thing, do join, if it doesn't work, and then paste it, and then you can do it. That's the one. I knew there was, I knew there was a way to do it, I just couldn't remember at all. Really just couldn't remember. Yeah. I was going to tell you. Right. Anyway. Anyway. 
Let's do some other stuff around here. I think mean, this is going to end up having like some sort of like window type thing on it. Uh, why? I have no idea. But that's what we're going to do. Fried flotation, how am I? I'm doing good, man. How are you doing? Not doing too bad. Do I have a Discord channel? I do, yeah. Yeah. It's in the, it's in the description of the YouTube video. Uh, YouTube stream, even. I haven't got it on my, like, Twitch or anything like that. Um, how often do I watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy? Weirdly, watched it on the weekend. It's just been added to Netflix UK. So, I, I, we, me and, um, my partner end up binge watching it. Freaking awesome. <laughs> it's a shame that they didn't put up the, um, extended edition, though, because there's some, like, extra stuff in there. Um, at the same time, we did have to take three days to watch it because of, you know, how long it is, so. Yeah. How's it going, Star Wars dude? Finish your homework. Cool. Well done. Well done, indeed. Right, so if I've got that kind of thing going on, let's build a, let's build a wall. Let's uh, do a Trump thing. Let's build a wall. Well, actually, not really a Trump thing. It's what Trump says he's going to do. Maybe. Has he actually built a wall? I know that's part of his campaign. It's the thing when we certainly have it. Uh, block for what am I currently building? Oh, I have no idea. Um, so just random stuff around because people wanted to see buildings rather than interiors, which is fair enough. You know, totally fair enough. So um, we're just doing some building, building work at the minute, um, mostly around like this farmy area. We did this like this was supposed to be a barn and it's a house, totally a house. Um, and then I ended up finishing up the roof of the brewery, which has been bugging me. We put in a little uh, like barn type thing for the brewery, and then we're going to have a, a, like some some uh, dock type thing so they can take ale and beer and cider and all that kind of really nice, yummy stuff um, somewhere else, you know? Right, let's get this down here. But yeah, um, that, that's pretty much what we've done. We have done too much. So he tries to build Hamburg from Germany. No, not at all. No. Um, so Hamburg, it's, it's basically the same roots. It's Anglo-Saxon, but I think what it means is just Tilfort. But yeah, everybody, all the Germans always say that. They always say, ah, you mean Hamburg. Yeah, if you're from Hamburg. I'm from Hamburg, so I think you mean Hamburg. You got it wrong in your in your video. Because you know what Germans are like. <laughs> I was like, I'm, I'm sorry, sir, but your spats is wrong. This is not so good, okay? It's not good, okay? Not good, no? Uh, but yeah. What do I think of Red, Redem uh, Red Dead Redemption 2? Not played it, but um, seen Sips play it. It looks freaking cool. Really does. I've not finished the first one, though. Um, the thing is, the first one, I'm sure, is on Xbox 360, and I don't think it got backwards compatible, did it? So I don't I don't think it was backwards compatible. But, um, oh, man, it was... I needed to finish that. Totally need to finish that, which means we need to get the Xbox out, really. Um, I have a half sex box, it says. Right, get those there. Just got your GCA, GCSE options. What should I go for? I don't know, it depends what you want. Um, you can either be really practical or you can go with the stuff that you actually want to do. <laughs> That's the two kind of options. Yeah. Home time is Austria. German accent is spot on. Excellent, I'm glad. Alles gut. Natürlich. Mm. And that's pretty much all I can really remember of German. I did get all right with it. I was never never brilliant at it. Ah, Bavaria. Bavaria. But yeah. Gotta love Bavaria. I like the flag. I like the flag of Bavaria. It's very cool. Oh dear. It's backwards compatible. Is it? So can you wait, so the first one, can I play on Xbox One? Red Dead Redemption. Can I play that on Xbox One? If I can, I need to get that out. Um pretty much quit YouTube. Play that <laughs> solidly, finish it, get Red Redem Red Dead Redemption two. When it drops in price, all these things are too darn expensive. Um 
and then have like a you know then then maybe start YouTube again. What do you think? <laughs> what do you reckon? What do you think? That's Denkinzy. Played Minecraft for eight years. I've probably played it for longer than that. I think Heinrich. I think I've probably played it for longer than that. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing at the minute. I'm just putting in blobs. Blobs is always good. Oh dear. I do need to travel to Germany actually. I haven't. I've, I've always thought about doing it, like, because uh, German Christmases are really good. Well, they always look good in pictures. I say they, they should say they always look good in pictures. It doesn't mean they're actually that good. But everybody that's actually been during Christmas time has always said that it's like awesome. Or just buy it from the store. Oh man, I'm just gonna do that then. Yeah, so I, I'm just gonna quit YouTube like um, about ten minutes, and uh, and that's that's pretty much it. You know, I'm, I'm just gonna be gone playing uh, Red Dead for you know quite a while. The only thing I didn't like re about Red Dead was the music. I just, I thought it sucked because I was li I listen to a lot of music at work, and usually it ends up being game music for some reason, for some really bizarre reason. I end up doing like game music. Um, and I did listen to the whole soundtrack, and it's just like. Wow, yeah, yeah, you know, like, but with whistles, not, not actually the whole thing, but like, wow, do 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 It's like that all the time. Nein, Österreich. So why, why don't you like, why don't you like Austria? Or do you like Austria? I'm sure. Wait, Manawa, aren't you from Austria? I'm sure you're from Austria, from from previous memories. So you say it's boring, really? How can it be boring? It can't be boring. Surely that's communist lies. <laughs> uh. I don't know. I don't know. It's one of those things, isn't it? Games. But yeah. Oh, the, oh, sorry, the soundtrack. Yes, the soundtrack. Yeah, the soundtrack is hell of a boring in the first one. Man, ugh. There's just nothing to it. I think that's the that's the problem. There was just nothing to it, really. But, yeah, sorry. I, I was talking about one thing and then completely forgot. It's like I've got, like, fart brain, you know? It's brilliant. It's gone. <laughs> it's like that, that thought has disappeared from my mind. There, there we go. It's gone. No longer exists. Yeah. How's it going, Panda? Ah, oh, dear. Uh, right, Give for that. Second soundtrack's way better? Cool. I look forward to it. It's just expensive. That's the only thing. That's why I haven't bought it yet. It's the same with um, Assassin's Creed Odyssey as well. Haven't bought that. Um, because it's too expensive. But it's, that's the only thing with games these days. They just price tag is huge. Like, like I'm not shy of money. I'll, I'll be honest. You know, I've got, I've got money that I could spend on things, but it's, it's one of those things that I just go, yeah. Is it worth like fifty odd quid? Mm, and I can't decide. If I can't decide, I don't buy it. It's the same with um, Kingdom Come Deliverance. I've been waiting to like, I've been wanting to play that for a while, right? Mainly because of its really cool, epic, kind of, you know, uh, proper castles, you know, very historic. Um, and I'm sure it's got loads of ideas in it, and that's what I kind of like want to play it for. But it's still, I'm sure it's like still 50 quid, which just then puts me off, so it's like, yeah. It's one of those things. Though I think it was on sale the other day and I missed it. Because um, I checked my junk mail and it actually said one of the things that you're watching is on sale, and, and it wasn't because, you know, I'd missed the whole whole day. <laughs> but, you know, that's the way it is. Uh. So if that Red Dead was not released on PC, oh man, so was I. I was so annoyed at that because um, I am a PC gamer. Even if, like, those games, I might play with an Xbox 360 controller or an Xbox, you know, controller of some kind. I'm pretty sure the only one I've got is 360, but, you know, I play with a controller, but 
on the PC. I kind of like that because then you don't always have to play it on the PC if the controls suck. Um, or you just suck at the game, which, which also does happen with me. But um, yeah, I, I was so miffed at that. My language is Austrian and I'm Afrikaans. Afrikaans. See, Afrikaans is such a cool ass language when you hear it. It's so freaking weird. Because um, I tried to learn Dutch at one point, and it's got like, well, it's quite Dutchy, you know? Well, you would definitely know. But um, it's just like when you actually hear it, it's totally different than. <laughs> than. than. Um, than Dutch. It's just it's just so weird. The sounds are totally different. But it's so cool as well. Very cool. Oh, anyway. So we've been streaming for one hour and 45 minutes, so I think I will end up stopping the stream in a little bit. I just end up chilling out instead. I don't know what I'll do. I have no idea what I'll do. I'll probably get put some TV on. It'd be boring. <laughs> Watch some TV, have an early night because it's goddamn cold. And I'll probably have a shower. Oh, that'd be good. That'd be good, actually. That'd maybe heal me via magic. It's African South Africa. Any good? Was that was that any good? It is African South Africa. Maybe I don't know. You can speak it, Trill. Oh man, you have Dutch, Trill. I did not know you were half Dutch. But then I didn't know you had kids until you um you posted that they both have channels and I was like I was, I was thinking you were way younger than 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 what you must be to have two kids that have now got their own channels. It's really good. J Buzz sounds like Dutch though. Okay. Oh. <laughs> uh. Right, let's kick that into there. Spanish is a good language to learn? Yeah, Spanish is a good language to learn. The thing is with Spanish is that um, there's so many, obviously, countries that speak Spanish that you can kind of go anywhere with it. It's like English. It's one of those. Definitely one of those. But yeah, Spanish is good. Uh, the thing is, if you do Spanish, then you can kind of get into Italian from it. That's the other thing. So, definitely worth, worth doing. What am I doing with this goddamn block? I'm, it's not looking good. Rubbish. See, there's always duchies in there. As soon as Dutch comes up, then all the Dutchies come out and they just start speaking Dutch. It's brilliant. I do love it as a language. I absolutely do love it as a language. It's one of those that I do want to pick up again someday. But it's one of those that, because um, Quitster was um, was one of the admins on uh, the Dacraft server back when it was around. Quitster was um, yeah one of the admins. He was Dutch. And he just said, your Dutch is absolutely terrible, Decker. So, that was from me actually trying to learn it properly. <laughs> But I appreciate the honesty, because <laughs> if it, if it doesn't, if it's like really difficult to understand, then that is just that's just not good, you know. Yeah. Uh, no, that's good. Hellhood. Can I speak some Dutch? I don't really know a lot anymore. Um, a lot of it I've forgotten, but it's like, uh, what will you eat? So, what will you eat? And, what speak me? That speak me? That I don't remember, but you know, um, it pains me. I, you know, I'm sorry, kind of word for that. What speak me? That's pretty much it. But that just, uh, I can't remember how to pronounce it, so it doesn't sound right, so I know that's wrong already. Uh, but yeah, what will you eat? Um, can you begrijpen? That's a nice one. Begrijpen is really, really difficult though. So I'm sure I fucking murdered that. Um, <laughs> what else? Uh, 
And pretty much Hale Hood is the only other one that I know. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much it, you know. Yeah. I like how I've just been doing like a wall for like the last ten minutes at least. It's been kind of like going on with this. It's crazy. Alright. Oh dear. Is this alright? Is it okay? Good enough? That's good. Okay. So maybe by me not practicing it, it's actually made it better because I'm not trying anymore. Behapen was a bit off? Okay. Yeah. It's it's really difficult because of the um sound, you know. That's the that's the bit that's really difficult to get because I think if you get that then I think it will fall but if cuz like me I'm trying to do it. I think cuz I'm trying to do it it just all like falls to crap really. But you know, it's just the way it is. But I don't know, one day I'll learn Dutch. What I would love to do is learn it learn a language good enough to actually do like videos and stuff in another language that that freak people out. So much, you'd be like, wait a minute, something sounds off by his accent. And I'd be like, uh, yeah, he's, he's, he's actually British. And you'd be like, they don't speak other languages. No English speaker speaks other languages. Because that's usually the case. <laughs> you know, it's only like really rare people that come across that do. Thanks, Trill. Thanks, man. Right. Let's finish this damn wall. What's going to go in with, within the wall? I have no idea. Yeah. No idea. At all. Oh no. I can't even click on these. Should, what I should have done is grab, gather up a load of different blocks and then just use those, but instead I'm just like randomly clicking the blocks and just recycling them instead, which kind of works, I guess. Netherlands is the best country in the world after the USA. Okay, fair enough. Need to build a wall. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, that'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? For, for live reputation. Just a random video in Dutch. Like, I won't... I'll change, obviously, obviously the title to it, to it being in Dutch, you know, in Dutch, but... um. I won't explain that I'm going to speak Dutch now. I won't say anything like that. I'll just start talking. Really freak people out. That'd be good. That that sounds like fun. All right, cool. We've done the wall. Oh, it's so much better now that I've actually done the wall. I think I need to do that with all of them. Like all of these walls here. I think whenever I build them, I need to do the, like the detail on them because it just smooths the whole thing out so much. And there's bits that I know that I can like need to add on extra bits. You know, like here and blah. There we go. Done. Uh, and like cut this bit down to like there or whatever, you know, but apart from that, it's pretty good. So we can get onto like a, a dock for that side. Um, I think we need some more fields and things around here. We do need to at some point put a path going off into the woods. Um, so we need to think about where it's going to cross. Uh, it could actually be across here, couldn't it? It could just jump across, go into the woods, and then be like a woodland path. I don't know. Yeah. But pretty good. Alright, I think that's going to be it for the stream anyway, guys. Uh, what's the plan for the future of this build? Does it never play games? Um, continue building um, until we're finished. I mean, we need to. I need to. I need to see how much. Uh, actually, wait. Let me finish record. Uh, stop the uh, recording thing. Majiggy, what's it called? Replay mod. Okay, that's why I've got it in there. Here we go. Now I can actually have a look at my FPS, which is. Oh, it's only thirty-eight, forty-eight. So actually, it wasn't as high as I thought. It was like three hundred odd. But that is on extreme. So to be fair, 35 F FPS on extreme render distance are still pretty epic. Um, yeah, that is still pretty epic. Oh, it's on 50 or something. So I know you guys can't see it because I've got the, the stuff in front of it. Um, yeah, what are we working on right now, the tracker? Um, we were working on like uh, the back of the brewery. So uh, we did build this little hut thing. I don't feel like we've done a lot. <laughs> I really don't think we've done a lot, but maybe we have. We did the walls. I like the walls. They're, they look really nice and wavy and stuff. So they actually look really cool. So I don't know. Hmm. 
what we'd put around these areas though. You know, I'll have something around it. But yeah, we will build like a little dock for the brewery type thing so they can get their ale around. How's it going, Glob Blob? I love saying the name, Glob Blob. Some of your camp camping as well, how's it going, man? Um, but yeah, uh, the plan is just keep building until we finish up the next episode. I hope in the next episode we will get mostly around to this bit. Like, that's the idea that um, the next time, like, so I think it's episode 7. I think it's only episode 7 or episode 8. I have no idea which one it is. But we can, like, finish up a lot of this area, which would be great. Because then we've gone, done, like, uh, well, we've done a lot. And there might be some of the bits that I have to, you know, do, but um, then we can get back inside again. I kind of want to mix doing the outside and doing the inside, you know, of the city. It's one of those things, I don't want to, like, finish up the outs inside of the city and then outside it's just, like, nothing like, you know, Edoras in Lord of the Rings where there's no darn fields around, which is really annoying. I don't want that kind of, like, feeling instead of rather have lots of stuff, you know? But I don't know. Anyway, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed this. Um, and hopefully it's worked alright for you guys on Twitch as well. And there's three guys on Twitch. So that hopefully that's worked alright. Uh, I know the chat is working, which is good. It's really good. Uh, and apparently I can actually switch between the chat. Maybe. No, it's just to, to actually do a message. But I can send a chat back message back to all of them uh, at the same time. And I'll have a look at what's why Smashcraft is broken. So it wasn't able to connect. I don't get it. But yeah, have a good night, guys. And um, I'm sure I'll see you a little bit soon, though if I've got this cold and it gets worse, then I might not be streaming. That's the only thing. So, I'll let you know. I'll let you know on Discord anyway, if I'm like really ill and, and dying. Um, hopefully not. Uh, that'd be good. But yeah, have a good night. Bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye.